Find the area of the given region. We want to know how many square centimeters fit inside of this figure, this region. Uh, now let's see if we can identify all the sides and how long they are. Let's start with this side. How long is this side? 17. This side is labeled 15. Now this side is the same as the 17 side over here. So this is also 17. Okay. Now 5 is the length of this. How long is this? Well, look over here. This is the same length, isn't it? So if this is 4, this must be 4. And then we know this is 4. But I never identified how long this side was from here to here. So let's label that x and see if we can tell something about this. Now I know 15 is the distance all the way across that. And that's made up of this, this, put down the 4. And this, put down the x. And then this, put down the 5. And if you add up the green, the red, and the green here, you'll have all the way across this, which we know is 15. Okay? Now, if you have x and you have 4 plus 5, you're going to have x plus 9, aren't you? 4 plus 5 is 9. That's still 15. Subtract the 9. Take away the 9. We're going to have x equals, and 15 take away 9 is 6. So the x up here is 6. x is 6. Label this side then 6. Okay? Now, the area of the region. First of all, the region is a rectangle. Okay? The length is... Um, 15. The width or the height of it is 17. And when we multiply those, you find out how many squares fit in the rectangle. Okay. And then from the rectangle, we're going to subtract out. We're going to take some scissors and cut out that part. We're talking a four by six, a little rectangle up here. It's four for here. This side is four and this is six. So we're going to cut out with scissors. We're going to cut out a four by six. So we'll subtract that out of there. And then we'll have the area inside. Now, 15 times 17 is 255. And you have centimeters times centimeters is square centimeters. And then you, from that, you take away the 24. Take away 24. You're going to have 231 square centimeters.